Hello, Year Zero and One children from St. Helier's School. In the last video, we learnt all about the tunnel shape from Case of the Caterpillar. In this video, we're going to practice some more letters that also use this tunnel shape. These are the things I have to practice my handwriting today. A whiteboard, a whiteboard marker and a razzle dazzle rag. If you have these things, they work perfectly fine, but also you could use a piece of paper or a scrapbook and a crayon or a felt or a pencil. All of the letters we're going to practice today have the tunnel shape in them. Remember a tunnel starts on the left hand side, it goes up and over and comes down back onto the line on the right hand side. Before we can practice our letters we need to set up our page with a margin and some lines. So remember down the left hand side of the page you draw your big tree trunk this is like the margin in your book and then you can draw three branches coming off your tree trunk which are the lines that you're going to write on if you'd like to you can put little butterfly eggs right by the tree trunk on the sitting on the lines and these will show you where you need to start your writing on each line on the first line we're going to practice a letter that makes the n sound like nest or nearly or nine. Can you think what letter that is? It's the letter N. So we make the shape by doing a short stick that starts halfway up the line. Then keeping your pen on the page, you go up and over and do your tunnel to, to touch the line again. Remember in between each letter, you need a finger space. Short stick, tunnel, short stick, tunnel. Are you ready for a crazy one? Remember with these crazy ones I'm going to do something wrong or a little bit crazy or wild with my letter and it's your job to see if you can work out what's crazy about it. What do you notice that's crazy about that one? So Okay, it's jumping on the trampoline on this side and it's going too low down on this side. So we need to make sure that our both sides of our tunnel touch the line. Are you ready for another crazy one? Okay. What's crazy about that one? It's too tall. Remember, there's this imaginary dotted line and our tunnels should only come up to touch that dotted line. Like that. On the next line we're going to practice a letter that makes the sound mmm for milk and mail and match. It's the letter M and it's very similar to the letter N except instead of having one tunnel it has two like this. So we have a short stick and then two tunnels. Tunnel, tunnel. All of our tunnels need to finish touching the line. Short stick, tunnel, tunnel. Okay, are you ready for a crazy one? Short stick, tunnel, tunnel. Did you notice that the tunnels are different sizes? Yeah, that makes it a bit crazy. So try and make your tunnels a similar size. Are you ready for another one? Short stick, tunnel, tunnel. Did you notice that it's dropping below the line there? And my tunnels are a little bit low. You can use your imagination to see that dotted line and then your tunnels have to come all the way up to touch it. On the next line, we're gonna practice a letter that makes a sound er like rat or rabbit. Do you know what letter that is? It's the letter R. So it's very similar to the letter M and the letter N, except when we're doing our tunnel, we have to stop our tunnel halfway through, like this. Short stick, tunnel stop. So when you get halfway through your tunnel, you just stop. And that's how you make a letter R. Don't forget your finger spaces between the letters. Short stick, tunnel, short stick, tunnel, short stick, 
tunnel. Ready for a crazy one? Short stick tunnel. Did you notice what's crazy about that one? I've let it, I've let it stop a little bit late. So you want it to stop when it's right at the top. Like that. Okay. Here goes another one. That one's pretty good, except it's jumping on the trampoline, isn't it? We need to make sure that it's sitting on the line. On the bottom line, you can make up a little bit of a pattern with the letters that we practiced today, N, M and R. So I'm going to do R, N, M, R, N, M, like this. R, short stick, half tunnel, N, short stick, tunnel, and M, short stick, tunnel, tunnel. Okay, then we start the pattern again. Short stick, tunnel, short stick, tunnel, short stick, tunnel, tunnel. I wonder what pattern you could make up. Thanks for following along with Casey the Caterpillar handwriting today and practicing your tunnel shapes. In the next video, we're gonna practice some letters with the open mouth shape. Hmm, I wonder how many you can think of. There's lots of those too. Alright, see you next time. Bye!